it insulates it a little bit. Commercial crabbing is an expensive, expensive thing to do. It just, I've got 15 crab pots out. I don't know, that's $3,000 worth of crab pots. Buoy lines, covers, snow machines, sleds. This is expensive to do. But I do it because it's fun. I enjoy being out here. We're some of the few people in the world to get to come out on the Bering Sea with snow machines and enjoy. I mean, it's really neat. There's foxes out here and seals and ravens usually follow us around. I don't know where they're at today. But it's, it's, uh, it's different. There ain't, not, there ain't another commercial fishery like this in the world. Give me some slack. I got to go down. Well, two keepers. We've come out here on days like this and it'll be uh, sometimes 20 or 30 crabs in one pot. You'll fill up a whole tote, like that big green tote full of crabs on just a couple of crab pots. But uh, not yet today, I don't think. Okay. Took the crab. And... Oh. No, I've, I've had a lot of practice of falling in these holes over the last 18 years, so you just know when you're gonna fall in and you kind of leap for the other side at the same time you're falling in. These crab pots are what we use for commercial summer crabbing. We're getting them in and out of the holes. A little different story here. Get her up. Yeah, he's in. I thought he was on the outside. They can't get out of this one. Well, we'll go the other side. The line's still hooked up. A little better. Six big ones. Well, I think we, uh, we had a good day's work out of it, and uh, we averaged two.